When people see Bluehost advertising prices as low as a few dollars per month, it's easy to assume that's the full story. But like most hosting providers, there's more behind the numbers. Understanding how Bluehost pricing really works can save you from surprise costs later and help you make smarter, long-term decisions for your website. In this video, I'll share five practical tips that explain the real cost of Bluehost so you can plan ahead and get the best value possible in 2026. The first tip is to know that the price you see on the homepage is a promotional rate. It's the discounted price for your first term only. Once that term ends, your hosting renews at the regular standard rate, which is higher. That's not a trick. It's just how the industry works. The smart move is to sign up for the longest term available right from the start because that locks in the low promotional rate for three or even four years instead of just one. It's one of the easiest ways to save hundreds over time. The second tip is to pay attention to the plan length before you check out. Bluehost gives you the biggest discounts on longer plans. Choosing a one-year plan costs more per month than a three-year plan, even though you're getting the same hosting service. If you're serious about keeping your website online for the long term, committing to a longer plan is almost always the smarter financial choice. The third tip is to be careful with add-ons during checkout. Bluehost offers optional features like daily backups, advanced security, and professional email. These tools are great once your site is established, but you don't need them to get started. Beginners often check every box because they sound important, but that can add unnecessary costs. Uncheck the extras for now, focus on getting your site live, and you can always add the services later once your website starts generating traffic or income. The fourth tip is to take advantage of what's free. Bluehost includes several features at no extra cost that many people don't realize they're already paying for elsewhere. Every plan includes a free domain name for your first year and a free SSL certificate, which protects your visitors and adds the little lock icon in the browser bar. Those two things alone would normally cost at least $50 a year if you bought them separately. Bluehost also gives you one-click WordPress installation, so you can launch your website in minutes. The fifth tip is to plan for renewals and growth. After your first term, your plan will renew at the regular price, but you can delay that increase for years by choosing a longer term now. If your website grows faster than expected, upgrading your plan is easy. Bluehost lets you scale from basic shared hosting to Plus, Choice Plus, VPS, or even dedicated hosting without moving your site or rebuilding from scratch. That flexibility makes it a long-term solution rather than a short-term budget host. So what's the real cost of Bluehost? It depends on your choices. The basic plan starts with one of the lowest introductory prices in the industry and includes everything you need to launch a professional-looking website, a free domain, SSL, and reliable performance. The long-term value comes from locking in the promotional rate, skipping unnecessary extras, and using every free feature they offer. If you want to see exactly how I set up Bluehost from scratch, how I picked my plan, installed WordPress, and built my first website step-by-step, -step, check out my full tutorial, How to Build a Website on Bluehost 2026. You'll find the link in the description below. If this video helped you understand Bluehost pricing better, giving it a quick thumbs up really helps the channel grow. And if you want more honest, beginner-friendly videos about web hosting and WordPress, go ahead and subscribe. There's plenty more on the way.